Hello, Ramsey Main DDS here. Antibiotics are always a big topic of discussion, and can antibiotics help my tooth? Do I need antibiotics before an extraction, after an extraction, before a bone graft, after a bone graft? There's so many different times that we may need uh, the benefit of antibiotics, uh, and perhaps sometimes we do not. Most often I receive a question online about a failing tooth that you were told uh, is infected and needs to be removed. And the question arises, well, should I be on antibiotics? Most infections that are within teeth are oftentimes uh, at the apex or the end of the root. They are oftentimes around a, a root canal tooth that is treatment plan for extraction because it's fractured or a crown cannot be made for it. And these you know, infections, quote unquote, or inflammation uh, are chronic in nature typically. If your face isn't swollen, there's no pus draining, you don't have a limited opening, a bad taste in your mouth, a fever, chills, night sweats, most of the time antibiotics are not necessary until the tooth is removed and especially if a bone graft or a dental implant is placed at the same time. The antibiotics can be placed either in the IV during IV sedation or taken orally by mouth as, as pills. But antibiotics are not a cure-all. They do help to reduce bacterial counts and reduce infections that can occur. Uh, infections can and do occur and just because you are on an antibiotic doesn't mean that you will not get an infection. Uh, most antibiotics have some degree of what we call broad spectrum, spectrum nature where they do uh, kill some bacteria of all different types. Amoxicillin and perhaps clindamycin are the most common. There are others such as uh, Augmentin and z and other uh, very strong medications such as metronidazole, flagyl, vancomycin uh, that are not always necessary. Some infections do get uh, or can get out of hand. It uh, depends on your, immune, your own immune system, uh, other factors. Uh, do, you, do you take medications that can impair your immune system? Do you have HIV? There are many things that can cause in, uh, antibiotics not to work and infections to get worse. If an infection gets worse, oftentimes the entire family of antibiotic needs to be switched from like the amoxicillin, penicillin family to a clindamycin family perhaps, or what's called a culture and sensitivity is done in order to determine, well, what kind of bacteria are here? Do we need to um, determine by microbiological culture, take a, basically take some and grow them in a petri dish and expose them to different antibiotics and see which one works best against this infection. But antibiotics uh, are needed for some patients. They do have side effects, of course. They should be used um, conservatively, not too liberally. Um, and they can also cause issues within the gut, uh, oftentimes a dose of probiotics or just simple uh, daily four ounces of yogurt with acidophilus can help reduce the chance of getting uh, upset stomach from antibiotics. Antibiotics are always absorbed better with food than without food, typically. But uh, just keep in mind that antibiotics are not always needed. Your dentist is ultimately going to tell you whether you need them or not. Um, and just be sure to follow through on schedule all the way through until they're complete if you are placed on an antibiotic. Sometimes only a preoperative antibiotic is needed, just a single dose at the beginning of an implant or bone graft surgery. Uh, that's typically done by IV in the, uh, in the IV sedation in the arm. A dose of antibiotics can be given then, and sometimes there, there's not need for follow-up. But again, they are not always necessary on all extractions. Uh, definitely on larger bone grafts, multiple implants, uh, even, even most single implants will require antibiotic therapy. Uh, they do not cure uh, failing apicoectomy teeth or failing root canal teeth. They simply provide a patch or a temporary band-aid for 7 to 21 days perhaps until definitive treatment can be done and it be taken care of. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any uh, comments or questions, I make it a point to get back to most all of them in a timely manner. Uh, Ramsey Main DDS, BurbankDentalImplants.com. Thanks so much for watching.